well, this is terrifying. Hi everyone. So you might have heard about style transfer where you can take the style of one image, let's say this painting, and apply it to another image, let's say this potato, and you can get masterpieces like this. Well, I try to render Minecraft in the styles of different paintings and video games. And if you're wondering why I did this, so am I. I chose Minecraft because I used to play it a lot when I was younger and I have so many memories attached to it and I thought it would be nice to revisit the game after so many years. Yup, that's the only reason. First we need to understand how our style transfer is going to work. It all begins with neural networks. Now if you're wondering what those are, they're just networks which are neural in nature. In 2015, this paper showed us how these networks can be used to make art. Turns out that if you pass an image with just noise to the neural network and also tell it what image you want it to look like, it's able to change the noise to look more like the image. If you don't care as much about the content as you do about the style, such as the brush strokes, you can tell it to pay attention to the low level details and it can extract the textures in the painting. Basically, you can feed it garbage and expect it to produce something useful. Similar to how school taught me that the mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell and now I'm expected to know how to do my taxes. So using these concepts, we can tell the neural net to have the style of one image and the content of another and it should find the perfect balance between both. Now, as cool as those pictures were, we aren't savages and this is the 21st century where videos exist. So let's make some. Sadly, the current method is too slow. A 10 second clip would take an entire day to make. As we know, time is money and I have neither time nor money. But we don't have to worry because in the world of AI, every 60 seconds, a minute passes and also a new paper gets published. Just a year after the previous method, a paper got published which would make my masterpiece clips a lot faster to make. I tried it and this was the output. It looks pretty good but there are still some problems. Firstly, we're still trying to make something out of pure noise and the output depends a lot on the initial noise we give to our model. Since we are rendering each frame separately, combining them together doesn't look very stable. It also kinda looks nothing like the painting but that's besides the point. But no need to worry, we can use a tool called EB Synth to solve this. You might have seen some videos made using this before. We just have to give it our video and an example of what it should look like and it generates videos more stable than the noble gases. Bet you didn't expect a chemistry reference. The best part about the AI behind EB Synth is that there is no AI behind EB Synth. It just tries to apply the textures from one frame to the next. And if we compare the output of this method to the previous one, the difference is pretty noticeable. Now I'm tired of talking so enjoy the clips. So yeah, those were my Minecraft masterpieces. The tools and code I used to create them are given in the description down below. If you like this video, please annihilate the like.